Hey, okay, so I talked to a lot of people that um, viewed my video about how my mom shot a man with a crossbow three times in the chest and then beat him all about his head with the long handle of an ax. Uh, he, they were dating at the time. I'll give you a little bit of backstory if you didn't, if you didn't watch that video, I will um, put, attach that video at the end of this video so you can go back and watch it. But it was my mother's boyfriend at the time or a, a boy toy at the time and somehow they got into an argument and he started acting very aggressively toward her um uh, flipped her refrigerator down onto the floor and i was advancing and he did not know that my mother should have been breaking legs for the mob and so my mom had a crossbow, a handheld crossbow stashed in her kitchen, as well as all kinds of other weapons, a uh, long handled ax for one. But so before he could get to her, she shot him. She shot him three times in the chest with a crossbow, which is crazy uh, to me. And then once he was down, she just took like all her repressed anger, I guess, for every piece of microaggression that she's ever felt from a white person. I don't know. She tore the fur off this brother, okay? So uh, I found out about all this when I went to court with her. I had no idea, no idea any of this had happened all the way up until the judge had cleared the courtroom and was reading the charges against my mother. It was a bit traumatizing for me because I was just like, lady, who are you? <laughs> what is going on? So anyway, anyway, like I said, watch that video. Um, but a lot of people wanted to know what happened to Mr. Daryl. My, my mother did not get uh, charged or, I mean, well, she got charged, but she didn't get sentenced or time or anything. The judge put a stat on it as long as she didn't get into any more trouble because she didn't have a record. And uh, I guess he figured that man must have did something for this black woman to go off on him like that. So he let her go. But a lot of people wanted to know what happened to Mr. Daryl. He lived, okay? Mr. Darrell survived. This was not a manslaughter charge. This was not an attempted murder charge. This was not a, a murder trial. He, this was an assault trial. He lived, he lived. God bless his heart. God bless his heart, Mr. Darrell, wherever you are in the world. I'm so glad you survived my mama. <laughs> It's hard out here for a pimp. I know it, Mr. Darrell. I know. But uh, <laughs> anyway, um, yes, he survived. Uh, of course, I never saw Mr. Darrell again because he had sense enough to stay the heck away from my mama with the temperament of a rattlesnake. Okay, she did. She had a temperament of a rattlesnake. She was not a nice woman. But anyway... Yes, Mr. Daryl survived, okay? Uh, I, I would love to tell you that he went on and felt the wife and had kids. <laughs> I don't know. I hope my mom didn't take his nuts when she, <laughs> she beat the daylights out of him. Good grief. Anyway, so <sighs> Mr. Daryl is alive out there in America somewhere. <laughs> hey, Mr. Daryl. <laughs> 